Okay, here we have our patient coming in for 10 days suture removal. We just took the sutures out and what I'm going to show you is the healing process. As you can see, the existing hair hides that suture line. If we lift up the hair, you will see that number one, Dr. Bolton does like to take more tissue than the average doctor. Most doctors stop behind the uh, ear. Dr. Bolton extends up past the ear into this area so you can see this is all bonus extra hair. As far as looking in to see the suture line, evidence of a scar, the only thing that really tips you off when you look into the scalp is that there's still crust from the actual sutures. They cling to the sutures. They're still present but on either side of the sutures in the middle is the line and I'm pointing to it right here. That's the suture line. So it is literally the size of a paper edge. And if you go down here and you focus in really tight, you're really not going to see anything of any consequence as far as a scar is concerned. It is literally practically a scarless surgery. So this is 10 days post-op. Imagine trying to find that suture line in 3 months, 4 months, 5 months, 6 months, a year, 2 years. Good luck. So if we rotate to the back, we can also see that the healing continues on. We hold up the hair right where I'm pointing with that point, metal point, is the actual line. And again, look at the length of the donor strip that Dr. Bolton takes for his patients. And that's why his results are so strong, because more hair equals a better result.